So, on my way to get Kristen, and uh, haven't seen her yet. There was some debate on whether I was going to Leyte or she was coming here to Cebu, where I am. But it's kind of a mass, mass cluster of action here with people coming in, but hopefully I'll be able to spot her, her boat and figure out where she's at. So I'm trying to get down here early to take care of that. And uh, as you can tell, this is a semi-organized chaos. And I'm hoping that I can just figure out from someone where she is. I guess I could just ask someone, but that's just too easy. So I think the boat comes in over this way. <clears throat> I think I should be able to, oh, sorry about that. I think I should be able to see it come in down here, but. Hello, where does, where's Roble Theresian Stars? Pier 4. Pier 4? Do, how do I get there? Do I walk down this way? Okay. So I guess I've got to walk a little bit. But it's a fairly large uh, boat, so I should be able to see it come in. Is it this way to Pier 4? Okay, thanks. Actually a nice breeze out today. So I should be able to come see this boat come in in this area, which I've taken it before so I know what it looks like, but I've taken it overnight. So I'm actually walking in a big you of where I was before, but that's all right. I'm excited to see her, so. So I, I think where I just came from is where all the taxis have to stage. And then uh, I think it comes in like right around this area here. But I don't know why it's it just, well, actually I, I do know why it doesn't. There's. There's some smaller boats that I've taken before from that terminal. <clears throat> but this is actually kind of, it takes a lot of freight, the boat that she's on. So um, that's why I think it's more like some of these ships that you, you see here. But anyway, I'm gonna pause for a moment until the see the boat, see the boat come in. And then uh, Hopefully we'll find Kristen. We have found Kristen's boat. And there it is. So I'm going to try and keep up with it. I have no idea where it's going to dock. But uh, I've been waiting for an hour. I think an hour, maybe an hour and a half. And uh, just wanted to make sure that I was there. Make sure she's going to be okay. So. Hopefully we will see her very, very soon. So when you're excited to see someone, it's amazing how slow the time goes. But there I was waiting for an hour and a half because I didn't want to get her lost down at the port. And I had to spend another, I don't know, half hour watching this boat spin around slowly with these guys throughout for the anchors. And then watching a miss was hilarious. One guy hit it spot on though. I think I caught him here. Anyway, the port side guy wins. Starboard side guy, you lose. And there she was. Very highly anticipated arrival. Finally made it. And I was pretty happy. Hi. <laughs> 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 
How are you? I'm good. Good? Yeah. Awesome. How was the trip? It was nice. You ready to get a uh, taxi out of here? Yes. Yeah? Alright, let's navigate all these people. I think it's hard to get a grab or something here. I think it's better if we walk over this way. I think there's like a line of taxis. <laughs> Bro. What took you so long to get off? You can't push your way through everyone? Yeah. You can? No. <laughs> so you're hungry. Yes. Yeah? <laughs> Alright. Uh, yeah. Well, we can go. Your hair is so like soft. Oh. Your bag's not heavy. <laughs> Maybe when you weigh a hundred pounds things are heavy, but uh What's that? For me it is heavy. Yeah, for you it probably is. She's like, my bag is really heavy. So can you take it when I get here? <laughs> and I just feel this thing and it's like, it feels like it weighs about five pounds. So anyway, some foreigners desperate for cash, I'm sure. It's hard to find uh, money sometimes around the province. Yeah, I think there's a lineup of taxis over here. So, well, I only waited two hours. <laughs> She's like, come at four. So I thought, well, I don't want her to be standing around and then uh, she doesn't know where to go and hard time finding her. Because, I mean, this place is, uh, trying to find someone would be like, Needle and haystack. I don't see really too many. No, I'm good. Too many, too many marked buildings, and uh, so it's probably going to be pretty difficult to find Kristen if I don't. <clears throat> anyway, we're gonna, gonna focus on trying to find us a ride here. I'll let you know. You pulled the card, they really stopped the music. <clears throat> Where's the card? Yeah. <laughs> you don't trust me? <laughs> you don't trust me? <laughs> so, surprise, surprise. What does Kristen want? Lechon. Lechon? Yeah. <laughs> Kristen wants Lechon. So we're going to go to the Leichon restaurant. We're going to get a grab yeah. car right now. So for you non-US people, or for you US people, that's uh, <clears throat> pretty much Asia's answer to Uber. What? We have a different service called Uber in the US. Yeah. It's like Grab, but it's not Grab. Okay. It's actually in a lot of places in the world, but um, uh, Grab is really only in Asia. I think it works in Thailand and a couple other places. Bye bye! We're getting dinner. Hey, thank you. Good evening. Is this our guy? Okay, I've made taxi mistakes before, so. Here, hold that one. Yep, that's the one. Got it, Kristen? Go ahead. Oh. oh, nice and cool, thank you. All right. Zubochon. What can you sell? <laughs> Zubochon? Did I say it right? I did. All right, we're going. We're going high end late late show tonight. This is our first night together. 
So we're going high end late on. Hello, is this the late on over here? Wow. Look at that beautiful. That's what that's what Kristen likes right there. The skin. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got. Menu special. Uh oh, we got music. Gonna have to cut that one. But anyway, we got a dynamite to start, which is about four U.S. dollars, and then you're gonna get the boneless zubochon. The boneless, the small platter, and if we need to get more, we'll get more. But Kristen said she only wants a skin. And then I'm gonna get the Halo Halo. And that should finish us off. So is it good to be back in Cebu? Yeah? <laughs> You're what? You miss Cebu? You like it here? Yeah. Yeah? Well, I think you're gonna have to learn to like it because that's where I'm gonna be. So, <laughs> we can split time between Leyte and Cebu back and forth. A nice ambiance here, and I'll keep filming as long as they keep the music down. So, you know how that goes. Alright, let's, let's give the dynamo my a go. Chrissy's cameraman. Is that cheese in there? Or is that the sauce? It's a just a chili? What is yeah. it, Kristen? Paper. Hmm? I think it's a paper. Yeah, it's like a... It's like a lumpia Shanghai paper, yeah. right? Yeah. With like a cream sauce. And then a... Okay. A chili? Inside, yeah, stuffed at the end? It doesn't seem that spicy though. A little bit spicy. No, I think, I think this is a pepper. Oh, it's a pepper? Yeah, pepper. Yeah. Well, Kristen rejected the dynamite roll here. It's so spicy. It's not that spicy. No, it's so spicy. I don't think she's going to like Mexican food very much. Oh, yeah. Look at this. <laughs> Sweet and sour sauce. <laughs> the face you just gave is hilarious. <laughs> she just like opened up her mouth to try and cool off. Drink some water. <clears throat> try these different sauces too. Are you gonna use sauce? No? You're a straight purist? I don't know what this is. Is this vinegar? I think so. Oh, that's a negative. And this has got to be soy, which I've tasted about a million times. Okay. You only have a couple skins left. Yeah. Kristen is very carefully preparing her lechon skin. Show us how you do it, Kristen. Is that? Is that? Yeah, yeah. So soy sauce mixed with, what is that, like onions? Yeah, onions and... And two chilies. Yeah. Are you sure you don't want to open up those chilies? No. <laughs> so Kristen's favorite part is the skin. <clears throat> so how is it? It's good. It's good? It's tasty. It's tasty? Yeah. All right. Well, I'm making some progress myself. What is, what is in this? Ice cream. That's ice cream? Yeah. Yeah, but what flavor is it? Whole beef. Huh? Whole beef theory. Whole what? Whole bees? Whole beef flavor. Okay, whatever she just said, we're gonna have to research that one. I don't know what. It, and then what's the next layer? Ice. Ice? No, that's something else other than ice right here. No, this one, the white one. Yeah, the white one. Milk. Milk, and then what's at the bottom? Like tea or beans? I don't Oh, coconut milk? 
All right, well, I'm gonna dive into this thing with my really manly spoon here. You should mix it. Okay. Well, today we learned a valuable lesson that just because you go to a nicer place and pay more for something doesn't mean it's actually better. So I gave this place a six out of 10. Everything was okay. The meat was meh, a little too fatty, didn't kind of lack some taste. The sauce was nice. I love sauce. You know that. And the Halo Halo, well, it couldn't even touch the one that we had at Dano Food and Drinks on Shergao. Yeah. All right, we have a major problem here. I'm always hot everywhere I go. So I turn on the aircon. And Kristen hates it. I don't like cold. She doesn't like cold. Could be a major relationship problem. <laughs> what, do you, what do you want? Gummy bears. She wants her gummy bears, all right. Interesting choice. Let's go find some. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Snipers. <laughs> 